Alright, so how's it going? And these are the top 5 or the best budget gaming CPUs deals that you can get right now on the market. So hey, if you're interested, links will be down in the description and let's just make this short and sweet. These are uh, one of the best value for money uh, CPU board RAM combos for the money, you know, that will give you really good performance and the best deals right now. So starting off with the cheapest and the first one that we have, which is the AMD Ryzen 3 4100. That CPU right now on Newegg after a discount or a promo code, it goes for 54 dollars this is an eight cores an eight threaded cpu and a quad core cpu so basically this cpu kind of performs to something like an horizon 4 4500 or a ryzen 5 3600 this is in the same territory of these both cpus so yeah let's just uh, say this is as fast as something like an i3 10 100f or even faster by like 10 to 20 percent so it's a very good cpu to pair with something like the rx 5700 if you're going used or brand new if you're going with the rx 6600 or even a gdx 1660 super or an rtx 2060 and you will not be bottlenecked if you decided to play any of the brand new demanding games eight threads or a quad core e threaded cpu will still get the job done now if you want an apu we have only one option right now realistically speaking which is the amd ryzen 5 5600g the reason i like this cpu because this is a six core 12 threaded cpu i have on myself i've been using it for as long as 12 months now and it gets the job done it's a very good cpu gpu option to go with if you just want a mini itx pc or a small form factor pc or you're not gonna get a gpu right now if you want to get a gpu in the future so yeah for 120 dollars you really cannot mess up now the best value for money budget gaming cpu that you can go as high as you'd want with which is the amd ryzen 5 5600 this is a six core 12 thread cpu right now goes for 140 dollars it really gets the job done uh, again you can pair this cpu with something to as high as an rtx 3070 or a 3070 ti if you decided to play 1440p uh, the reason i like this cpu because compared to the 12400f it's cheaper and it gets you around the same performance so for 140 dollars a really good cpu in my opinion and uh, it's yeah still one of the kings when it comes to gaming now the other cpus that we have which are basically a high-end cpu or a mid-range cpus that you can use it for high-end systems you know and the first one in my opinion which is a pretty underrated uh, cpu which is the amd ryzen 5 7600 this one goes for 200 twenty dollars and there's a offer right now that you can get the brand new star wars game with it so yeah the reason i like this cpu because it performs equivalent to an i5 13600k once paired with an rtx 4090 you know when it turns to of gaming results so yeah the only disadvantage here that you're not getting the same cpu raw efficient performance so you're not getting the same you know multitasking performance for example but yeah it's a more power efficient cpu you need a better cpu cooler to use it on this uh, cpu you know the stock cooler that comes with it is unusable in my opinion and yeah this is the reason why i like this uh, cpu so if you want a high-end cpu just for gaming to pair it with something like an rtx 4070 ti 4080 even and this is the one to go for over the i5 13600k if you wanted to save money and on top of that you are getting an access to the x3d versions and the next gen ryzen cpus and also ddr5 but if you want the best value for money a gaming cpu and you want the extra edge when it comes to the cpu multitasking everybody loves the i5 13600k and for the right reasons uh, would you go with this cpu over something like a ryzen 7 7700 uh, that's debatable in my opinion but yeah it costs around the same and it's something that i'll leave up to you but gaming performance is the same and also the video editing performance the cpu intensive application is kind of trading blows but again until it's taken the upper hand because it's got more physical cores and more threads actually so yeah the 13600k seems to be the best cpu for gaming right now for around 300 dollars and these are the best budget cpus in my opinion that you can build right now or you can have right now um in may so yeah if you like the video press on that like button if you want to see more videos of that kind subscribe and i'll see you in the next one peace